Hello everyone, this is David and I'm back again with For My Class Web, a YouTube channel that provides free digital learning content. Uh, the content is designed by a professional teacher. Please, you can make your donation through this number. That is 0722-284-499 to support the studio where these videos are recorded and you'll be blessed. Otherwise, you can subscribe to this channel and continue getting more free digital learning content. Now, there is this question that was number 40 from the science paper for the year 2019 and it was asking about weeds a topic that was covered in class 4 the candidate was supposed to remember about some of the characteristics of some of these weeds and the candidate was supposed to state which weed ca that ca that cannot be effectively uh, controlled by a protein well, if you analyze these four different weeds that are given here, that is Mexican marigold, oxaris, watering dew, and blackjack. Mexican marigold is a weed that has got a taproot. So once you try to um, uh, to uproot Mexican marigold, you'll find that it is it is likely that it can come off together with its taproot. Now for the watering dew, this is a, pra a weed that normally grows along the ground. And by trying to uproot it, you'll find that it is possible to remove all the roots because they are kind of grow, they kind of grow as though they are fibrous root. The, the same case with the black jack, it has got a tap root system. And once you uproot it, you find that it is possible to remove the whole of the plant. Otherwise, let us analyze oxaris. Now, oxaris itself, it is a weed that has got three robes. One, two, three. It has got three robes. And it has pink flowers, as you can see. Now, this uh, weed grows upright, but it has no aerial stem. Now, its leaves and flowers arise from a small bulb, that is a tuber, that are found under the ground. And the tuber look something like you can see here. Now, the underground bulb remain dormant and can regrow later. Therefore, if you try to uproot oxalis, it's most likely that this bulb is going to be left underground. And after some times, it is likely to shoot again to grow to a new plant. And this factor makes it uh, difficult to eradicate oxalis from the ground because of the fact that this tuber here which is succulent can be left under the ground and as you can see it can regrow later something more that somebody needs to note here is that oxalis can be used as a vegetable that is it is edible especially this succulent tuber here if you chew this succulent tuber it tastes kind of a sugary it is kind of sugary and also the leaves if you chew them they are sour and they've got kind of they, they have got kind of a taste that is acidic they have got acidic taste so this question required the candidate to remember about this factor here otherwise oxalis could have been the best choice for that question you can subscribe to this channel and continue getting more and more free learning materials. Thank you very much.